hello guys and welcome back to this channel again it's your boy Simon Kofi in this video today in this video I'm going to be showing you new parts of my life as an African living in the village today I am on the farm and as what Amaya said God used five days out of the six days he used to create the world God used five days to create Africa to make sure that everything is in place in Africa and on the sixth day he created the, the rest of the world you understand <laughs> so today in today's video i am on the farm and he also said that the soil of africa is good to the extent that even when you sow a human being it will grow <laughs> you don't believe it Abby. you follow me i'm on the farm i'm just coming to do something i know there are so many of you that take palm nut soup you use palm oil and you use like so many things that are made of palm and in today's video, in this right video, in my farm, I've realized that one of the palm fruits on this tree is ripe, has ripe, so I'm going there to harvest it. So I would like to take you around in this process so that you see how palm fruits is harvested right here in Africa for our personal consumption. <laughs> see you! The ripe palm fruit is right here. But before we can have access to it, we need to clear all these things out to get access to that one in there. So you watch the video. We are going to clear everything and get that fruit for our family soup today. As I told you earlier, after clearing one or two stems, the stem that is holding the palm fruit is right here showing. Watch me as I cut it. That's it. Voila. So today, that is the process we use to harvest palm in Africa. And today, this evening, this thing is going to serve as food or we're gonna sell it it's either we're gonna sell it or we're gonna use it to make soup for our african delicacy you can either take this thing with fufu banku even with rice you are good with it or you can use it for oil or you sell it so this palm oil the palm here has so many uses to us as africans yeah this is how we remove it from the house the stem first, then when you get home, you'll be removing it one by one from the house. This one is hard, so we can't remove it right now. We keep it for another day, and it should become soft before we can remove it. For now, we just have to cut it off the stem. done for now we have to pick it from the ground into the bowl we send it to the house and we keep it for another day maybe two or three days and it will become very soft then we can remove it from the husk one by one like this it's very hard so we have to remove it one by one before we can use it for the soup thank you for watching this video up to this end don't forget to like share and subscribe to this channel because we want to take africa up to the world Peace out.